So to find the magnitude in this example, all we simply need to do is basically you guys can see that it's just like a right triangle from here. But the dif dis difference is if you were going to try to find the magnitude from over here, you'd have to find the change in the y's, square them over the change in x's, like you did over there, right? But since you, have, since you wrote it in component form, now my vector is from 0, 0, so I can just say it's 7 and 4, right? So it's basically going to be my magnitude, which we would write as <coughs> um, magnitude of my P, PQ. is going to equal to the square root of 7 squared plus 4 squared. And that's going to be 49 plus 16. So that's going to be square root of square root of 65. And just notice how I wrote the magnitude. I wrote this kind of like it looks like a double absolute value. It's over there. Okay, So that would be my magnitude. 